good YouTube scrappers going to get some more stuff. Here's a dryer, here's a washer, maybe a washer. things are so stinking heavy Air conditioning on today. It's only about 
15, 16 degrees Celsius out right now. Some aluminum east thrust and stuff up here. Anything else? Uh, turn your back on. It's a water cooler. Water cooler is full of water. Maybe you won't. Maybe you'll have children. Maybe you won't. Maybe you'll divorce at 40. Whatever you do, dance. Even if you have nowhere to do it but in your own living room. Get to know your parents. You never know when they'll be gone for good. Be nice to your siblings. Uh, I'd say the garbage you truck is down here the somewhere. You need the people you knew when you were young. Travel. Prices will rise. You too will get old. Respect your elders. Don't expect anyone else to support you. Maybe you'll have a trust fund. Maybe you'll have a wealthy spouse. But you never know when either one might run out. Don't mess too much with your hair. Or by the time you're...
to the washers. Decide whether I take this old frame or not. Another blessing, another door. And hugs. Remember hugs? And strengthen me. We're here to help you get through this with tips, resources, another steel and door. real support from fellow Mainers. Thank you, so Lord, for the blessing. Visit strengthenme.com awesome. or call 207 I need some for my chicken coop. Tired of flying away, tossing and turning, just hoping for a few hours of sleep? Get the sleep you crave with the one-of-a-kind Tempur-Pedic. Only Tempur-Pedic uses proprietary temper material that continuously adapts and responds to your body to relieve pressure, so you get deep, uninterrupted sleep. All night, every night. The Tempur-Pedic Summer of Sleep starts now with all Tempur-Pedic mattresses. Dishwasher. K&D dishwasher. start let's see so yeah yesterday the temperature was in the probably high 90s low hundreds today it's like 17 degrees Fahrenheit Celsius <laughs> it's gonna have a hard time getting to about 60 uh, we got construction they're filling some potholes which is cool. All right, I'll turn you back on. Uh, I'll just keep that on. Potatoes planted.
maybe there will be less swerving going on here now that the holes are filled. cooker I got that because it's got a little bit of steel and a cord
Hey. And this is all just stuff here when we moved in. Oh yeah. I can't take the fridge because of the Freon. If it wasn't for that, I'd take that too. But... Yeah, I know. I'm. I just scrap stuff. So. Oh, do you? Yeah. I've taken a couple days off work just to. I've loaded this thing up about 10, well, 15 times. Big garbage pickup man. They were, everybody driving around with trucks taking. Yeah. Things, I guess. All right, that was a good stop. Got an oven and a wa and a dryer. And then they said, "Hey, do you want to?" Hot water heater, just like sure do, with some good brassy and copper bits on it. It's awesome. Uh, not enough to stop. Turned out to be a pretty good day. day for scrap. That was interesting conversation with that lady. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, I didn't videotape a conversation just because I don't know. I don't know. I I don't. I don't know what you guys think about it, but I I just don't like videotaping other people if I don't ask. And I know if I was somewhere and somebody was videotaping me, I don't think I would enjoy it too much. But anyway. It's just one of those things that happens. I definitely don't videotape when there's kids around, so. first and if she's just remember the cardinal rule if someone is picking through a pile just keep on going don't intrude on their picking
Yeah, let's see what this uh, this one. Uh, Out on the back, I have all the glass all over everywhere. There. I found more of those medicine cabinets than the little. Everybody. This is another video. I'm adding on to the current one that I'm adding on to yesterday's. This is the last village that's gonna have large garbage day this month. Um, so fire on a half ton again. I think over the last Two, three days I've picked up I don't know somewhere between 12 to 15 loads of scrap I'll show you my back lawn later it's intense now I've got to uh, get processing it I'm just on my way to work see what we can find today okay bye we'll see you in just a few minutes so still haven't found anything um, yeah so this morning I had to let my vehicle run because we had frost so it's May the 29th still have a good killing frost up to somewhere in the middle of June yeah so anyway we're just having a drive through the country again see what there is for junk out heading like I said before heading to work after work I'm gonna have to process some stuff hopefully my uh, my yard will drop a trailer off and I can fill her up with shred steel get some uh, videos of what it weighs what it pays and get a paycheck or I should say, second paycheck. Yeah, so anyway. I was hoping that 
since I had the GoPro on, we're going through the country, I'd catch some uh, video of some uh, wildlife. A moose, a deer, a bear, a turkey, a something. Just as long as when they walk out in front of me, they give me enough uh, notice and I can slow down and not hit them, because I wouldn't be cool. Uh, we're starting into some more rural areas here with. Maybe a vacuum. I hold the window down so I don't accidentally lock myself out. There we go. That's what I like to see. So I can see. I think that's it. That one. we got it here. Looks like 
like a humid X system. and there are nails in the boards and these bundles. Thank you. Well, that was nice. It's nice to let you know that there's nails in there so you don't skewer yourself with a nail. Nice little spot to go fishing down there. flat screen television or not. We'll soon find out. <clears throat> no. through this this part last night and got a few things stuff in there but nah. not enough metal not enough wire in there to take that lights were just in a big round ball I'd probably take them but the way they are it was just too much too much work for what you get out of Christmas lights Christmas lights are like maybe 10 cents a pound <coughs> <coughs> How's it going?
microwave, a fan, and a carried coffee maker. So we're almost at the end of the of the road here. Fair amount of junk out here. We'll take a look at. Christmas lights. I wish I had a subscription to uh, Scrap Pallet Man's is uh I can't even what he calls it. His snap tool. Big piece of equipment coming. You gotta get out of the way. video so remember 
you enjoy the entertainment if you enjoy the content please like and share subscribe and uh, you can check out all the other scrapping videos on YouTube you just do a search and you should be able to find guys like the Canadian treasure hunter and vandal vlog and scrap pallet man and tin man and simple man he does he does some really cool stuff the simple man he he'll show you how to take a lot of stuff apart a lot of air conditioning units and it's pretty cool um, vid vulture he's another good one that shows you how to even if you don't have a half ton, he'll show you how to make money off of off of finding stuff in dumpsters and how to clean it properly and properly and get the most out of your your junk. Um, there's also Oki Scrapper, the Arkansas Picker. Like there's just there's a lot of them out there and I know I missed some that I watch um, taco stacks another one paper moose she does a lot of flea markets and state sales and does a lot of picking and it's pretty cool what she'll come across anyway Hope you enjoy this and uh, anyway, everybody have a good day and an awesome weekend and get out there and get picking. Get out there and gather up all the junk and make sure it doesn't go into landfills and that you can recycle, reuse or resell. Alright everybody, have a good day.